Hello students, good day. I'm teacher Alvin and I will be your teacher for today's online class. Today, I'll be teaching science. But before we go and proceed to our discussion, let's watch first our documentary. Beautiful Birds Part 2 7. Eagle E A G L E Eagle Vocabulary Powerful Prey Excellent Talon The eagle is a large powerful bird of prey It has a large hooked beak and excellent eyesight. It has powerful talons which help it catch prey. Now let's proceed with our vocabularies. Our first vocabulary word is battery. 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 Now, let's spell the word battery. It's B A T T E R Y. Battery. Very good. Our second vocabulary word is source. 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 Now, let's spell the word source. It's S O U R C E. Source. Great job! Our third vocabulary words are Power station Power station Power station Now, let's spell the word power station It's P O W E R power S T A T I O N station power station very good now we're ready to discuss our topic for today and our topic for today is where does energy come from again where does energy come from anything that give us energy is called a source of energy let's start with heat energy for Example, the sun gives us heat energy, and the sun is a source of heat. We also have a stove, and a stove gives us heat energy. A stove is a source of heat. We also have 
the oven. An oven gives us heat energy. And an oven is a source of heat. That's why we can bake some breads, cakes, and cookies. These are some examples of this source of heat energy. Let's proceed with light energy. For example, a light bulb gives us light energy. A light bulb is a source of light. We also have the sun. The sun gives us light energy. And the sun is a source of light. Next is fire. A fire gives us light energy. And a fire is a source of light. And even the lightning in the storms gives us light energy. And a lightning is a source of light. And lastly, we have electricity. For example, a battery. A battery gives us electricity. A battery is a source of electricity. Just like our phones. Our phones are using battery. We can use our phones because the battery has an electricity that is stored in it. We also have a power station. A power station gives us electricity. And a power station is a source of electricity. We can use our televisions in our home and charge our phones because the power station supply us an electricity. Let's do our wrap-ups. Number one, what form of energy does a light bulb emit? Do you have any idea? And if your answer is light energy, your answer is correct. Number two, what form of energy does a power station give? Any guess? And if your answer is electricity, your answer is correct. Number three. What are the two forms of energy that the sun emits? Any guess? And if your answer is light energy and heat energy, your answers are correct. Very good. Thank you for watching. Hope you learned something new today. And please don't forget to wear your mask regularly and wash your hands often. Stay safe. And again, this is Teacher Alvin. And see you soon. Bye!